What's your status? Hello? Can you... Come here, deputy. We need to talk. I didn't properly introduce myself back there. Most folks call me Dutch. I've been trying to piece together what's happening up top. It ain't good. Little I can gather is that your partners are alive. For now. Seems they've been split up. Each one handed off to a different member of Joseph's family. You want them back, I get it, I get it. I got friends that have been taken too. Problem is, there ain't no help coming. Nobody knows what's going on here, and they won't know until it's too late. There's got to be people out there willing to fight back against this cult. We just, we need to show them how. We need to build us a resistance. So the first thing we're going to do is get control of this island. Once we got some breathing room, we can figure out what's coming next. There's a gun and a map in the safe over there. Take them. I'll give you a call on your radio once you get your bearings. Be careful out there. It's crawling with Peggy's. Those fuckers are willing to die for that psychopath that's leading them. Yeah, I never imagined I'd be teamed up with an officer of the law. I know, I know. Sheriff Whitehorse probably told you everything you know. But Earl and I, uh, we go way back, you might say. Uh, a minor infraction here, knockdown charge there, a couple of bar brawls once upon a time. <laughs> but I always thought he was the biggest asshole I'd have to deal with. Until Joseph fucking C moved in. should have been more generous. They won't be long for this world. 
These loony fanatics are out of control. If you want to protect yourself, I think there's a prepper stash near the boathouse. Should have some good gear squirreled away. <laughs> 